record. Overall, Cleveland on an eight-game hitting streak. A right hand bat, and he hits it in the air. Pretty deep left center field going back. Waggley's at the wall, and it's gone! Brett Cleveland homers for a fourth consecutive contest with a line shot over the left center field wall. His ninth home run of the year. And the Wing Nuts lead two to nothing here in the bottom half of the first inning. Brett Cleveland with a new team record homering for a fourth consecutive ball game. A line try that just the first pitch and he swings and lines it through the right side of base hit. Around third base is Juan Richardson. Here comes a throw to the plate by Jay Krause. Richardson slides, and he's safe for the plate with the wing nuts third run. Delgado goes first to third base. It's an RBI single in a right for Josh Workman, jumping on the first pitch from the appeal. Righty against righty. Bellerin stands deep in the box, and he chokes up on the bat. The 2-1 pitch and a high fly ball in a left field. Waggle going back. He's at the track. He's at the wall, and it's gone! Edwin Bellerin with a two out, two run homer over the 385 mark in left field. A two run shot that gives the wing nuts a six nothing lead. There are two outs, bottom of the first. And the pitch breaking ball grounded up the middle. Tough play. It hits the bag and it goes into center field for a base hit. Robin scores. Conroy right behind him. Conroy scores standing up. A two-run single up the middle for Josh Horn, who now has three RBIs in this inning. It's eight to nothing. Wichita they only have five base hits. They've taken advantage of three walks and an error. The three-one of Cleveland hit in the air to deep left field. Back goes Waggle. Back at the wall, and it's gone. Brett Cleveland with his second home run of this inning. His fifth in the last four ball games and his 10th of the year. And the Wingnuts now have a 10-0 lead in the bottom half of the first. Cleveland in almost the same spot. And he hit his home run. Those three walks added up to the pitch count. 1-0 pitch and a high fly ball into left field. Waggle going back onto the track, back at the wall, and it's gone! Jorge Delgado, it's the Wingnuts' fourth home run of the night. A towering fly ball just over the left center field fence. And the Wingnuts get the run right back. It's 11 to 1. Wichita didn't dig it. Went all the way towards the bullpen. Breaking ball line towards the middle. Base hit in the center field. Barrows will score. Bellerine holds a third base. It's a two out RBI single to center for Michael Conroy. And the Wingnuts now take a 12 to 1 lead in the bottom half of the third. John Waggle, the leadoff hitter, is waiting on deck. Right hander against right hander. The once you pitch swing and a miss. He struck him out. A foul tip held by Bellerine. Chad Sherman strikes out the side in order in the top of the fifth. An RBI double in the top half of the ninth. Here he lines it, caught by Richardson, and the runners will have to hold. Rutherford smoked in a rising line drive, and Richardson with a beautiful Six jumping down. catch. Josh Horn has hit safely now in 12 games in a row. The 1-0 pitch, and he hits it in the air, pretty deep left center field, going back, Jackson towards the fence, still going, and it's off the bottom of the wall. Connery in a third base, he'll be waved around by Kevin Hooper, and Josh Horn stands on second with an RBI double. The Wingnuts get a run back, it's now 13-4 Wichita in the bottom half of the sixth inning. LaSalle University this year, he went six and four, an ERA of 2.92, ground ball fair down the first baseline and rolling into the right field corner. Josh Horn will score from third. On his way to second is Juan Richardson, and Richardson is on second, standing up with an RBI double. The Wingnuts now have a 14. Wingnuts 14, Red Hawks 9 here on the top of the ninth. Tabata ready. The 0-2 pitch, swinging a ground into the right side. Robbins moves in front. He gloves it, throws to first. It's in time, and the ball game is over. The Wichita Wiggins have completed a three-game sweep of the Fargo Moorhead Red Hawks, winning tonight 14-9. Highlighted by a 10-run bottom half of the first inning. The Wiggins tie club record with four home runs. All nine starters scored at least once.